Hello, this is Xbox Ahoy, and this is the seventh episode of my Black Ops 2 Attachment Guide. In this episode, we're covering the DLC reticles introduced with the recent personalization packs. With each pack, you'll get four additional reticle options. One each for the Reflex, EarTech, ACOG, and Hybrid Scope. The Hybrid's reticles are reused from the other sites. The lower magnification uses the Reflex's reticle, and the higher magnification uses the same as the ACOG. So, there are three unique reticles with each pack. Welcome to the Jungle. Perhaps the most restrained of the DLC offerings available, the Jungle Warfare camo is a mottled autumn-esque blend of orange and green. The corresponding reflex reticle, Mill Dot, is a basic but very usable option. A central dot with four circular quadrants in high contrast orange. Look to the horizon for the EarTech reticle, a simple filled chevron indicating your aim with an errant line beneath. Rather than resembling the treetops, the ACOG's canopy reticle has a chevron indicating your aim, alongside a set of superfluous four horizontal dots and a vertical marked line. Should you feel flush, then the purchase of the Benjamin's camo will let others know you're in the money, your gun adorned with $100 bills. Ring up your opponent's register with the reflex reticle, ka -ching a golden dollar sign marking your affluence, as well as your point of aim. If you like the ear tech, then perhaps you should put a ring on it with the bling reticle, a golden dot circumscribed with a diamond ring. If diamonds are your thing, then you can ice your opponent with a reticle of the same name for the ACOG scope, an inverted round brilliant cut gem with the top facets indicating your aim. Celebrate your ancestors with the Dia de Muertos camouflage, with brightly coloured sugar skulls adorning your armament of choice. The reflex reticle is such a calavera. Pepe is a red sugar skull centred on your target. Win over your opponent's heart, if not their mind, with the Corazon EarTech reticle, a cruciform target marker adorned with an ornate cardiac surround. Finally, lay your opponent to rest with La Flore. This flower themed reticle sure to blossom into glorious victory. Take your fight to the streets with the graffiti pack, and tag your weapon with this garishly coloured camo. Spray down your foe with the tagged reflex reticle. Taking the form of a spray can nozzle, this option is sure to mark your turf. If stencils are more your scene, then the ear tech reticle might suit you. Your opponent's able to see themselves starring in the kill cam. If you prefer to take the high road, then the ACOG elevate site is the choice to take taking the form of a stylized arrow pointing to your mark. Japanophiles unite for a cute overload, with the kawaii camo pack decorating your gun in pink polka dots and chibi characters. The reflex reticle, Winky, appears as an amber smiling face, sure to lighten your enemy's mood. The cutesy uh-oh ear tech reticle depicts a happy little grenade in green, suddenly separated from its pin, which serves as your aiming device. The ACOG's Happy Bullet reticle depicts a squat rifle cartridge with anthropomorphic appearance and oddly gleeful demeanour. Any party rockers in the house tonight might have a good time with their namesake camo, principally hot pink leopard print with a side of zebra stripes. The reflex reticle is for those who fancy themselves a superstar, with two concentric five-pointed stars about a central dot, in a dashing shade of pink. The EarTex Turn It Up reticle is for those who like to amp up their performance to 11, with a pair of pink headphones proving only slightly less impractical than the Rocker reticle. Selecting the ACOGS option might just spin your opponent round like a record, and leave them with slightly worse injury than just a scratch. Zombie fans might like an undead mob depicted upon their weapons, and the gore-themed reticles reflect their flesh-hungry nature. Those seeking bloodthirsties might like the bloody splat option for the reflex sight, the perfect option to exsanguinate your foe. Alternatively, those hungry for headshots might enjoy the EATEX brains reticle, cerebral in form with a central dot to more precisely target your enemy's dome. Summon your own undead horde with the zombie ACOG option, with central blood splatter for lining up your shots and a host of glowing eyed zombies underneath. The Viper Pack offers a tactical snakeskin camouflage, with a variety of serpentine sights to sink into your foe. The first might tip the scales in your favour, a honeycomb-like hexagonal scaly array in red, with central dot to service your aim. Snake Eyes watching you with this large amber ocular optic, 
the perfect way to extend your EarTech sight. If you're looking for an optic with a little more bite, then the snake bite option for the ACOG will allow you to sink fangs into your prey, and will no doubt elicit venom from your foe. Now, if you want to go ham in the most literal way possible, then the bacon pack is perhaps the most delicious way to leave your opponent smoked. The porcine oink reticle might look like a cute rendition of a farmyard animal, but this little piggy will go to town if given half a chance. Fry your opponents with the delicious scent of the ear tech option and see them sizzle with rage. For those who prefer stealth bacon, sneak attack with the snack attack ACOG reticle by directing this bacon laden toothpick towards an unsuspecting foe. That's your lot. A whole bunch of cosmetic alterations for you to spend your hard earned cash on, should you deem it worthwhile. If gaudy optics are your thing, and you want to personalize your weapon, these DLC reticles are a sight for sore eyes. Thanks for watching, this has been Xbox Ahoy. Join me for the next attachment guide, when I'll be covering Select Fire. Until then, farewell.